Hello and welcome to my channel. When I first saw this white sofa with leather and rhinestones in it in the one nail salon I was visiting, I immediately came up with the idea that I need to do a nail design that will make the same look on the nails and now I'm sharing it with you. We will start by applying a white background. I'm using the white gel polish. Apply it all over the tip and cure for one minute in LED lamp. After curing, I apply the top coat. I'm using the No Cleanse top coat. Also apply it all over the white background and cure it in LED for one minute. If you're using the one with the sticky layer, you need to take it off now. Now I'm using this striping tape, doing one line, second line parallel to the previous, and the third one also parallel, and the last one again parallel with them and cut the extra. So now I'm doing the other lines 90 degrees to the previous one, so we will get this kind of pattern. And the third one and the fourth. Make sure that they all have the same gap between them. Okay. Now I'm taking the pusher and folding the sides, the free edge, the side wall, so I will not mess my design in the future. So now when we're sure that all of the tails are not keeping us from work, I'm applying the white gel polish on top of it. Exactly the one I used at the beginning for the background. Now, without curing, I'm taking the clear acrylic powder and liberally apply it on top of the white gel polish. It is always better to apply more than less, so after I applied it, I will get rid of the excess powder just by knocking on it. And now, I'm taking the tweezer and carefully removing the first row of the line. Well, not really the first, it's actually the last we applied, the second one. And be careful when removing them, because we haven't cured yet, it can destroy our design. And now I'm removing the bottom part, so just carefully take them off, like peel them, do not be in a hurry, because we want to have the really straight nice lines. If you're removing it and your line is not as straight, it means that you did not apply enough of the acrylic powder. You need to apply more than that. And now when the last one is removed, we will cure it in LED for one minute. Now it's time to add some shining. I'm using the flat hollow glitter, but you can also use rhinestones or anything you would like. So I'm using the orange wood stick to do the dots of the top coat and applying these hollow glitters right on top of them. So make sure you do not apply too much of the top coat because it will go on top of the glitter and it will not look as good. So I'm carefully putting this glitter in all of the intersections of our line working with the orange wood stick and cure it for one minute in LED. And now our design is ready. So the tip on the left, I did just a couple of the lines and they made a really different look of this design, I think. And the tip on the right is just one I showed you. So try this simple design. It is so easy. Like usually everybody who tries it for the first time, they can make it because there's nothing complicated in it. Thank you very much for watching, if you liked the video give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys later, goodbye!